Are you ready to witness one of the most breathtaking natural shows on Earth? Look up at the night sky and marvel at the Perseid Meteor Shower, an annual celestial spectacle that will leave you in awe. Join us on an unforgettable journey to discover the science and beauty behind this stunning phenomenon in our video on the Perseid Meteor Shower. What are the Perseid Meteor Shower? The Perseid Meteor Shower, which peaks in mid-August, is considered the best meteor shower of the year. With swift and bright meteors, Perseids frequently leave long wakes of light and color behind them as they streak through Earth's atmosphere. The Perseids are one of the most plentiful showers with about 50 to 100 meteors seen per hour. They occur with warm summer nighttime weather allowing sky watchers to comfortably view them. Perseids are also known for their fireballs. Fireballs are larger explosions of light and color that can persist longer than an average meteor streak. This is because fireballs originate from larger particles of cometary material. Fireballs are also brighter, with apparent magnitudes greater than minus three. Characteristics The stream of debris is called the Perseid Cloud and stretches along the orbit of the comet Swift Tuttle. The cloud consists of particles ejected by the comet as it travels on its 133-year orbit. Most of the particles have been part of the cloud for around a thousand years. However, there is also a relatively young filament of dust in the stream that was pulled off the comet in 1865, which can give an early mini-peak the day before the maximum shower. The dimensions of the cloud in the vicinity of the Earth are estimated to be approximately 0.1 astronomical units, AU across and 0.8 AU along the Earth's orbit, spread out by annual interactions with the Earth's gravity. The shower is visible from mid-July each year, with the peak in activity between 9 and 14 August, depending on the particular location of the stream. During the peak, the rate of meteors reaches 60 or more per hour. They can be seen all across the sky. However, because of the showers radiant in the constellation of Perseus, the Perseids are primarily visible in the northern hemisphere. As with many meteor showers, the visible rate is greatest in the pre-dawn hours, since more meteoroids are scooped up by the side of the Earth moving forward into the stream, corresponding to local times between midnight and noon, as can be seen in the accompanying diagram. While many meteors arrive between dawn and noon, they are usually not visible due to daylight. Some can also be seen before midnight, often grazing the Earth's atmosphere to produce long bright trails and sometimes fireballs. Most proceeds burn up in the atmosphere while at heights above 80 kilometers, 50 miles. What causes the Perseid meteor shower? The proceeds are caused by Earth passing through debris, bits of ice and rock, left behind by Comet Swift-Tuttle, which last passed close to Earth in 1992. The Perseids peak when Earth passes through the densest and dustiest area on August 11 to 12. Years without moonlight see higher rates of meteors per hour, and in outburst years, such as in 2016, the rate can be between 150 to 200 meteors an hour. How many meteors can you see per hour? On a more normal year, you can expect to see up to 100 meteors per hour at the shower's peak, according to NASA. Last year, the proceeds were affected by the full moon illuminating the sky and washing out fainter meteors. However, this year it will provide minimal disturbance to the meteor shower as it will only be 10% illuminated during the time of the peak. A typical proceed meteoroid, which is what they're called while in space, moves at 133,200 miles per hour, 214,365 kilometers per hour when it hits Earth's atmosphere. And then they are called a meteor. Most of the proceeds are tiny, about the size of a sand grain. Almost none of the fragments hit the ground. But if one does, it's called a meteorite. Peak temperatures for proceeds are more than 3,000 degrees Fahrenheit, 1,650 Celsius, as each fragment travels through the atmosphere and both compresses and heats the air in front of it. Most of the fragments are visible when they are about 60 miles, 97 kilometers, from the ground. When can you see meteor showers? 
Meteor showers are named after the constellation from which the meteors appear to emanate. From Earth's perspective, the Perseids appear to come approximately from the direction of the Northern Hemisphere constellation Perseus. You can see the Perseid meteor shower best in the Northern Hemisphere and down to the mid-southern latitudes, and all you need to catch the show is darkness, somewhere comfortable to sit, and a bit of patience. To find the Perseid meteor shower, it's a good idea to look for the point in the sky where they appear to originate. This is known as the radiant. According to NASA, the Perseids radiant is in the Perseus constellation. Though Perseus isn't the easiest to find, it conveniently follows the brighter and more distinctive constellation Cassiopeia across the night sky. The meteor shower gets its name from the constellation it radiates from. The constellation is not the source of the meteors. When can you see meteor showers this year? The meteors from this year's show are sure to create another dazzling spectacle that begins each year when Earth passes through a cloud of the swift Tuttle Comet's debris, according to NASA, causing small bits of comet dust to enter our atmosphere at 37 miles per second. The Perseid meteor shower is the result of space debris from the swift Tuttle Comet striking the Earth's atmosphere. When the dust disintegrates, it creates gorgeous bright streaks that light up the sky. The meteor shower has been observed for at least 2,000 years. For the best viewing, NASA recommends looking toward the constellations Cassiopeia and Perseus in the northeastern part of the sky, when the Perseids peak at 4 m. In conclusion, the Perseid meteor shower is a breathtaking display of nature's beauty and power that has captivated stargazers for centuries. As we marvel at the fiery streaks of light shooting across the sky, we are reminded of the incredible complexity and wonder of the universe. With the latest advancements in technology, we can now witness this stunning display from the comfort of our own homes. Subscribe to our channel if you are interested in space.